Yeah, you may want to get into a practice of every once in a while doing a diagnostic check with yourself. And go through your checklist of everything you have, all the love you get from your family, your friends. Go through everything and that will bring humility. That will bring gratefulness. And pay attention not to fall into this game of the mind. This game of the mind is me, 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 me. I am this, I am that, I am great, I am blah, blah, blah. I'm a great healer, I'm, I'm a shaman, I am a great businesswoman, I am better than other people, I am white, I am black, I am blah, blah and paying attention that you don't fall into that trap. And while you're running your diagnostic check of checking, looking at everything you have, starting with your health, starting with your family, your connections, and then you just, the list is long. It's a long list. You see you have a lot. A lot. We all have a lot to be grateful to. And not being focused on what you don't have. Yet you work towards improving your life and getting everything you want. But you're very happy with what you have and where you're at. You're grateful. It's very easy. It's very simple. You pay attention to that and you implement that in your everyday, whenever you remember, whenever you're cooking and your mind's going somewhere and you're pointing finger at someone else has more than you do, and life is not making a mistake, and you shouldn't be where you're at, you should be somewhere else, and life sucks, you didn't get your potatoes. Remind, if you remember, then you come back and you count everything you have, and you come back into this place, and you realize, you see it for yourself that you have a lot. We have a lot to be grateful of. And your life transforms, really transforms. The magic comes. Oh, it comes. Oh, it starts pouring in. Oh, you're going to see all kinds of miracles happening in your life. Left and right. As it's happening right now, as it is right now. Look, we have found each other. We connect with one another through the miracle of internet and computers and, and webinar. And get to give and receive this love that's binding us and connecting us with one another. And it's free. You don't have to spend any money to love and to, <laughs> to give love. <laughs> and the more you give, the more you receive. It's like free air. You can breathe it. The more you give your love, the more you're available to it, the more existence gives you back. It's amazing. I'm very grateful to have you in my life. I'm very grateful that Her Majesty, the Supreme Soul, changed the course of my life and brought me to this point that I can connect with all you beautiful people, going to six, seven different countries and being received, receiving so much love and gratitude and kindness. 
Um, I can only just say thank you and bow for what comes to me and be grateful for it. Be kind to yourself, be gentle with yourself, don't beat yourself up. Why you don't do this? Why you don't quit your cigarettes? Why you're still not going for a walk? Why you're not vegetarian? Why you don't meditate enough? Don't beat yourself up. You're doing a good job. Be kind to yourself. Be loving to yourself and accept love and kindness that comes to you. Receive it. Most of us have a hard time to receive. So just be gentle with yourself. You're on the right path. If you're hearing my words, you're on the right path. And all is well. Your, your spirit guide, your inner self, your higher self is guiding you in the right direction. You don't need to beat yourself up. Just be kind to yourself. Sending you lots of love and light. Many blessings. Namaste.